barber, you know, barber shops and hair salons have always been held to a high standard on sanitation through the State Board of Cosmetology and the Kentucky Barber Board. So we've had to add uh, additional things, which is, which is capacity mainly, which is the number of the people in the building. We don't have operational waiting areas, so uh, clients have to wait outside or in their car uh, until we notify them that we're ready to take them. Uh, we've implemented a program of uh, emailing and texting people questions beforehand. All of the questions were uh, regulated by with, um, have you uh, asked to been quarantined? Have you been out of the country? Things like that. We get those all answered before anybody gets in. Uh, all of the staff, before we begin, we take temperatures. Uh, some of the staff has chosen to, uh, and, and most of us are taking customers' temperatures before we start. Uh, and of course, social distancing the whole time. Uh, we have to wear a mask. Um, I know that that's been a, a big debate politically for a while, but our barber board and our cosmetology board dictate that customers and barbers and stylists have to wear masks the entire time. Everybody's been very understanding. Um, you know, a lot of the people that are coming in are our regular clients, but you know, we just take their temperature when they come in, just, you know, cleaning down the surfaces and the scheduling of appointments is a little bit different because we've never done, it's always been just a walk-in shop. But it's a very simple thing and it's really no big deal. It was nice having the time away from work even though you can't, you know, jet off somewhere. <laughs> I'd like to eventually put those airline miles to use. I love what I do and I think the people love to come in to me as well. They do, they have no question. And uh, I just, you know, I, I'm just very, Happy to be back at work. Other than that, just be patient, be kind, because, you know, we're, we're waiting these waters just like you are. You know, it's all new to us, too.